Hello Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Welcome to your monthly general reading for June 2020. Before I start, I'd like to thank everyone who have subscribed to my channel. Those of you who have liked, shared and commented, thank you all so much for your support. So Aquarius, we're just going to, you know, start your reading and see what the tarot and the universe has for you in the month of June. So Tarot and Universe, please tell us what is coming for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs for the month of June and what's going to be in your first position. Wow. The High Priestess. What is crossing or complementing Aquarius? Okay, Aquarius, let's see what's happening. Okay, you've got temperance. Wow, what's going to be the foundation for Aquarius in June? Okay, Nine of Pentacles was going to be in their recent past. Okay, Ten of Swords, what can be achieved? Ten of Pentacles. So what is coming for Aquarius in June? Okay. Knight of Wand. Okay, so how is Aquarius going to be or feel? Okay. Four of Swords. What's affecting or influenced the environment? Okay. This is the one that jumped up. Yes. Page of Pentacles. Hopes and fears. Judgment. What's the outcome? What's going to be the outcome for Sagittarius? Three of Wands. Okay. Wow. And the base is Ace of Swords. Okay. Right. Let's give it a minute. Right, Sagittarius. Sorry. I mean, Aquarius. <laughs> Sorry, Aquarius. Yeah. You've got this Sagittarius card here that has caused me to call you Sagittarius, but of course it's temperance, yeah? Um, you've got the High Priestess here and you've got temperance here, okay? I feel in June, you are going to experience some type of spiritual awakening, okay? Because this is the high priestess and you've got temperance, which is Sagittarius. And this is also ruled by Jupiter, okay? So you, can, you have to check where your Jupiter sign, which house your Jupiter is. But I feel like for most of you, it's affecting your psychic abilities, okay? And how you need to, um, how, you, how you need to balance things out, how you need to connect with people on a different level, okay? I also feel your subconscious is going to reveal certain things to you, okay? With the High Priestess card here. Because this is your energy okay so this is certainly complimenting you so I feel like in um, June Aquarius you are going to be really really going into um, astrology 
okay astrology psychic stuff getting you know messages from your angels that is how i'm seeing it here okay that is how i'm seeing it here also um having this um nine of pentacles as your foundation i feel here your your body is going to be very important to you i feel some of you will want to change your look or adjust your look okay um however i feel like it's more to do with what you are putting into your body rather than what you are doing to your body okay i feel like here because this is venus in virgo so uh venus is beauty so i feel here um or sometimes it could be business okay i feel here is more to do with your body your physical body what you are eating what you need to stop eating what you are doing to affect your body in a way that hasn't been too brilliant okay that is how i see it here and for some of you it is your finances and your career that you are going to focus on for some of you is going to be both okay let's say if you feel like um you want to start a business or start a new job i feel for some of you you are going to feel like i need to look a certain way to get this position this is how you are going to achieve it so i feel like it is to do with your eating your sleeping and your physical body okay yes and that will also link you you also will feel like it will link to your finances okay yes so we've got the 10 of swords um here so i feel um for some of you certain situations that you need to um confront you know you are you have confronted certain things that you need to you feel you need to get out of your system i feel like yes you know because this is also an air sign card and so i feel like whatever you are leaving behind you know your subconscious is going to reveal certain things to you in return okay you are going to find balance that you need you know but i feel this is going to have more effect on your physical body okay whatever you do however spiritual you get i feel your physical body is going to be very very important to you in whatever you do i feel for some of you is career driven and for some of you is spiritual driven and for some of you it could be that it is spiritual and physical okay so for what can be achieved i feel for some of you this could be a family issue this could be an inheritance this could also mean that you are working hard to achieve long term um success but i also feel some of you is to do with your family you know extended family however you see it mother father uncles or whatever it is some of you could be getting inheritance but i also feel like whatever it is um it could also mean that um you become more attached you become more interested um in getting much closer to your relatives that is how i'm seeing it here okay that is how i am seeing this here like proper physical bonding with your extended family or people you consider to be your family okay that is how i see it here and for some of you it's purely to do with business and long term success achievement you know something that you have thought of doing for a long time because you've got this 10 you've got this 10 here you've got two 10s here so um yes some for some of you is finances for some of you it's your loved ones that is how i see here this is what can be achieved okay i've got the knight of wands here 
So having this Knight of Wands here, I feel this um, Knight, I feel he's he's got some information, you know? Some of you may get a guest. Because, I, I, I mean, some, I feel like in June, uh, there's going to be um, a lot of relaxation in rules and laws. For some of you, you may be even traveling. This could be you traveling. It could be someone traveling into your orbit. Okay. And this one may, this person may surprise you and you might not. I feel this is someone you've not seen for quite a, a while, but they'll be coming into your, your life. Okay. This could be an old mate, but I also feel this person coming in for some of you is going to bring you ideas that is going to help you move forward with your career for some of you. I feel this is someone you know that you haven't seen for quite a while. Like you've not seen them for a year or two or you've not heard from them for a year or two. But they, I feel like they're coming into your life and once they come into your life, something is going to happen and you're going to be like, oh, let's, let's plan this, let's do this. And this is going to become a career or something that you know is going to yield some ideas that is how i'm seeing it and having here i feel for some of you meditation will be quite important to you yes meditation is going to be quite important to you in june that is how i, I see with this card i don't feel like this is necessarily traveling but i feel you will feel the need to calm down whatever you're doing you need to calm down and and chill out that's how i'm seeing it here you're going to be relaxed but in the relaxation it's going to be more spiritual relaxation meditation going to places where you find religious activities that will calm you down. If not, you just want to chill out. Okay? But I also feel like here, you are going to be, you will feel a lot of calmness and peace within yourself. Okay? That is how I'm seeing it here. And having this page of pentacles here, I feel it's still connected to your base, which is um, uh, your foundation, which is this, um nine of pentacles here which for some of you is business of course some of you is business and if this is what you can achieve okay so whatever talent it is whatever idea you have i feel when this night comes in you are going to come up with ideas that you know you used to have before but now you feel like it's the time to, to do something about it. That is how I see this because this page also comes in and brings you a message. So it makes sense. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. For your hopes and fears, I feel for some of you, it's time to let certain situations go. I also feel for some of you, you could be coming into contact with someone who is famous, okay? But I feel whatever you are doing, some of you is going to bring you fame with this card here. Whether it is, I don't know, fashion business, whatever you are doing, it is going to is going to bring you fame, is going to bring you, because you've got this high priestess here, you've got temperance, and you've got the judgment, okay? But I also feel having here, you will be making judgment on yourself and decisions that you have made in the recent past to check um, whether that you, you, know, you are in alignment or it's in alignment with your highest good. For some of you, okay? But I also feel for some of you, whatever you choose to do, you are, um, 
it will lead to fame. And for some of you, I also feel like, you know, your angels are bringing you messages. So I feel like, yes, psychic activities is going to be really, really high for you, Aquarius, in June. Okay? Yes, because just see where, whether your, your Venus sign or your fourth house is. Yes? Because Cancer rules the fourth house. So if the high priestess is here and, you know, she comes with angels. So, yeah, I feel like, you know, there's going to be some interesting stuff coming up. And of course, your outcome is the three of wands. Okay. So having this three of wands here shows that I feel whatever information you get from this knight of wands and the page of pentacles, you are going to take it and run with it. Okay. Because I feel after you've judged yourself, and realize that yes, you are in alignment um, with what you want to do. I feel you're going to go ahead and do it and look and plan ahead. Because you see, this is nine. So this is an achievement, accomplishment. So you will go ahead with your plans for your long-term goals. And I feel for most of you, it's going to be your body that you're going to um, whatever it is, I feel like you will, you would need your body to, to do it, you know, whether it's modeling or something to do with physical body, you know, something to do with the physical body, whether you want to launch a beauty product, whatever it is, is to do with the human body. That's how I feel here. Okay. For some of you and for some of you, it's all spiritual. Okay. Um, yes, yeah, so I think I'll leave it here, Aquarius, and um, I'll, I wish you all the best. I'll see you next month or you see me next month.